Hi everyone, I'm Chloe and I'm here with this week's virtual picture news. So let's get started and take a look at this week's picture. What can you see? Is there anything that you like or dislike? Do you have any questions? Use the clues in the picture and some of the questions that you've asked to make a prediction as to what could be happening in the news this week. Let's look at this week's story. New data has shown that 2024 was the Earth's hottest year on record, warming by 1.5 degrees Celsius. Around 200 countries had agreed to try to keep temperature rises below this, as scientists say that temperature increases could mean more extreme weather, including heat waves, storms and wildfires. How does this week's story make you feel? Perhaps you're disappointed that, in spite of our efforts, global warming continues to be a problem. Or maybe you're distressed by things you've heard about extreme weather recently. Whatever your initial emotion response, now might be a really good time to pause and share your thoughts and feelings with the people around you. Let's look at this week's big question. Who should be involved in key decisions for the world? This week's poster image is of Lahore in Pakistan. It often floods here during monsoon season, which is June to September. But over recent years, the flooding has worsened which experts believe is linked to climate change. Share what you know or are aware of about climate change. What is climate change? Climate change is the long-term change in our world's temperatures and weather. The Earth has been warming up more quickly over the past 100 years. Because of this, many places have seen changes in weather, including flooding, droughts and heat waves. Since the 1980s, each 10-year period has been warmer than the previous one, according to the UK Met Office. The European Copernicus Climate Service, who monitors world temperatures, found that 2024 was the world's hottest on record. What extreme weather took place in 2024? In April, the United Arab Emirates received almost a year's rainfall in 24 hours. Roads were submerged and flights from the international airport were grounded. A heat wave affected many parts of Asia in April and May. In India, red alert temperatures of 47 degrees Celsius happened at the same time as the general election. Austria experienced its warmest summer on record. Spain had its hottest August ever recorded. Finland tied for its warmest summer. And Switzerland recorded its second warmest summer. Look at the global average temperature change chart. What trends do you notice? Think about the quote from climate change activist Greta Thunberg. I have learned you're never too small to make a difference. Do you agree with her? Why? 
Whose responsibility do you think it is, ultimately, to take care of our planet? Is it individuals, education, world leaders? What do you think are the most important things to consider in terms of climate change? Do you think enough is currently being done? Take one last look at this week's picture and big question. Share your thoughts. Reflection. Our actions have a direct impact on the world around us. It's everyone's responsibility to be aware, from individuals to governments and world leaders. This week's fun fact. Did you know that the world's first fully solar powered airport is in Cochin in India? It's proof that we can use really creative solutions to tackle climate change. I wonder what creative ideas can you think of to help protect our planet? As always, we love to see what you're doing in school. So please do share any of your amazing thoughts, ideas or challenges and I'll see you next time.